Hello everybody, this is Amazing Spidercon here, and I am going to give you an update on a comment that somebody gave me about being able to do split-screen multiplayer. So one of the uh, things that I told you before is that uh, in my previous video that you might not be able to play uh, with the public servers on Left 4 Dead 2, which is true, but what you can do to get around that to play with your friends is you can set up a virtual LAN connection through Hamachi. So essentially what this will do is it'll bypass the public servers and allow you to play with multiple people, especially with the person that might not have the game on remote play. So what you'll do is you'll start up the game, uh, and especially for the person who's going to host, they have to start up their big picture mode because if they're going to be playing with the other player, they have to have two remotes and they have to have a remote themselves. But everybody else that joins that already has the game does not have to. So I'm going to go ahead and start up the game. And you basically want to send the Hamachi... Uh, the Hamachi main server uh, numbers to other to your friends that you're gonna be playing with, so, and they also have to join the server. And the great thing about these Hamachi servers is you're gonna have five people at once, so you essentially will have no problem being able to play with four people as long as you're consistent with those four people, or you kick people off that you want to, and then rejoin, or you know, set up new servers. You can set up as many servers as you want with Hamachi. So essentially, what you want to do is you want to open up your developer console on the main. And what you can do is you can do map, and I'm going to do C1, M4, Atrium, and I'm also going to do it on survival. So this is something that you can do. If you if you look up survival, there we go. What you can do is you can either play, you can do campaign, survival, realism, you can do turned, all those different things. Uh, basically, as long as you put down the map, the right chapter, the right uh, map number, according to what map you want to play, and then space, and then whatever... Uh, whatever game mode you want to do, uh, you just do it that way. So now what I'm going to do is I'm, I'm right going to connect you. underscore split screen. Yeah, you are going to kill some Local zombies host with me. Two. I'm going to let that load up. And right now I have the secondary my uh, laptop that has the game by itself. So the Amazing Spider Cut Two account is basically going to be joining through Hamachi. So right now, I have both the Hamachi account and, or both Hamachis basically connected to each other. So these computers are connected uh, through, a, uh, through a virtual LAN. And what you're gonna do, what your friend's going to do essentially, or the people that are gonna play with your uh, split screen buddies, or you and your split screen buddy, is they're going to uh, start up the game, open developer console, and type in connect, space, and then put in the main uh, the main IP address, which the one that I had to put in, or the one for my Hamachi, was two twenty five point twenty nine point two five three point one five nine. So if you connect that way, and the thing is, they don't have to uh, use to get your, your other people that it. don't split screen. They don't have to use I'll a mouse and keyboard, but uh, or I mean a uh, controller, but you do. So the one you split screen with, you here. have to use a controller. But they don't necessarily have to. So here we go. And now I am playing Rochelle. See? Coach. See? There I am. Shooting right now. Just moving around. See? The amazing spider can too. So that's how that's how you can play split screen multiplayer with multiple people. And then you see me there, I'm just gonna shoot. Right there. I don't know why it shoots kind of like a shotgun. That's a little weird, isn't it? But uh, yeah, that's how you do it. Uh, I tried to basically make it to where you could do a uh, a double split screen, but it always breaks and it always tries to put me back into a public close. server when I do it. So maybe somebody could develop a program. Everybody grab a weapon. Or a I could try to do something. I could get in contact with somebody that could do a. Uh, you could like set up your own mini dedicated server through Hamachi. And maybe there's like a way you can mess with the game files to allow a double split screen. So you don't have to have like, you know, you can have basically two people that don't own the game play in one match. But for right now, the only thing that you can do is have one free player, one player that doesn't own the game, be able to split screen on the main host, uh, on the main host through the remote play. So I would essentially have to invite the friend that I want to invite Grabbing first through aid. the... Uh, through through the main computer, which is this one, the one I'm moving around right here. But uh, yeah, that's how you do it. I uh, hope you guys have a good day. If there's any more questions, then just uh, put it in the comments below. Thank you.